I don't know, that still sounds like an awful thing to legalize. All the dangers are right there on the package. It's legally required. Who reads labels, though? Can I help you with something? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. Wait, why? Do you have a problem, or... Did she kill somebody already? Relax, I just need to speak with her. Good. Samara's the first Justicar I've seen on Ilium. If I'm lucky, things will stay peaceful. She went to the commercial spaceport a few hours ago. If you want to get there, the pedestal on that balcony will summon a cab. Just be polite when you meet her. Justicars embody our highest laws, and they usually stay in Asari space. She's not used to dealing with aliens. Is Samara really that dangerous? If you fall, but they're... If someone tried to bribe her, she'd be obliged to gun them down as a matter of honor. Tell me about the Justicars. They're a monastic order. They've given up their families and possessions to follow their code. Most of them are on some lifelong mission, but they'll always stop to deal with any injustice they encounter, which can be a problem. In some ways, they're a lot like the Spectres, undertaking personal missions. Spectres are authorized by the Council. Who do Justicars represent? What? That's, like, I don't know a good human metaphor. They represent their code, our code. It's closer to a religious group than a legal branch. No law-abiding Asari would question a Justicar's orders. Nobody becomes a Justicar for personal gain. And they die before breaking their oaths. I'm looking for Samara. Like I said, she's at the commercial spaceport. You can hail a cab at the pedestal on that balcony over there. Where do you think you're going? I'm taking my goods to Omega, Detective. You're not going anywhere, Merchant. Not until I solve this murder. I had nothing to do with that. It was those mercenary thugs you can't seem to get rid of. The victim was your business partner, and I'm not ruling you out. I'll let you know when you can leave. What about that Justicar that just showed up? Everyone says she might go crazy and start killing. I need to leave. She'll only kill the unjust, so I'm sure you have nothing to worry about, Pitney Four. Find me in the station if you need me. What do you want? I've already got mercs wanting to kill me like they did my partner. I don't need any more trouble. As if that weren't enough, some Asari Justicar showed up this morning. All the natives are scared of her. I've got to get off of this world. Has Samara actually done anything yet? The Asari say that Justicars are lethal in a fight. And if they so much as smell corruption, they start shooting. The thing is, corruption isn't that hard to find around here. Tell me how to find the Justicar. She's in the alley where my business partner was murdered. A detective sealed the area, so you'll have to talk with her if you want to go there. I should go. I wanted to be a Justicar when I was young. Every sorry does, I guess. <laughs> nice guns. Try not to use them in my district. What can I do for you? I'm looking for an Asari warrior named Samara. If you've got a score to settle with Samara, take it somewhere else. I've got more than enough trouble here already. I need to find Samara and get back to my mission, with or without your help. Sounds important. Justicars usually work alone, but they are drawn to impossible causes. That's convenient. If you're getting her out of my district, I'll get you to her ASAP. She's at the crime scene. You're awfully anxious to get Samara out of your district. My bosses want me to detain her. They're worried she'll cause some kind of cross-species incident. Her Justicar code won't let her be taken into custody. If I try it, she'll have to kill me. 
I have no interest in dying. So if you lure her away with some big noble cause before I have to carry out my orders, I'm thrilled to help you. Samara would kill a cop? That doesn't sound very just. She would die defending an honest cop, but she'd fight an army of dirty cops to the death. I admire her dedication, but her presence is still a big problem. I need her gone before I have to carry out my orders. Your superiors are sending you to certain death for no good reason. You have a right to disobey. Shepard knows impossible odds. Believe me. Most of the time I'm not being stupid about it. I can't say the same for Anaya's superiors. I'm a cop and I know my duty. I've been ordered to detain her and I will. Unless I can get her to leave my district first. How do I get to the crime scene? It's around the corner. Go outside, take a left. Look for the police line. I'll send word to let you in. Be careful. The local Eclipse mercs have been all over those back alleys lately. I have to go. Good luck. Let's find Samara before the detective has to. Anaya told us to let you through. Watch yourself. There's Merc activity back here. We're waiting on backup. Those were my best troops. Tell me what I need to know, and I will be gone from here. Where did you send her? You think I'd betray her? She would hurt me in ways you can't imagine. The name of the ship. Your life hangs on the answer, Lieutenant. You can kill me, but one of us will take you down, Justicar! What was the name of the ship she left on? Go to hell! Find peace in the embrace of the goddess. <laughs> wow. My name is Samara, a servant of the Justicar Code. My quarrel is with these Eclipse sisters, but I see three well-armed people before me. Are we friend or foe? That Merc was wounded and helpless. Do you just kill anyone who won't help you? If my cause is important enough, yes. Are you different? I can't say that I am. That is something we share. You are honest. That is another. How may I be of service to you? I need you to help me take down the Collectors. The Collectors are a worthy foe. I would relish testing myself against them. But I seek an incredibly dangerous fugitive. I cornered her here, but the Eclipse sisters smuggled her off-world. I must find the name of the ship she left on before the trail goes cold. I wish you were willing to go with the human, Justicar. I've been ordered to take you into custody if you won't leave. You risk a great deal by following your orders, Detective. 
Fortunately, I will not have to resist. My code obligates me to cooperate with you for one day. After that, I must return to my investigation. I won't be able to release you that soon. You won't be able to stop me. Uh, the human is lost here. Can one of you clarify? I was trying to convince her to leave with you, but just a car is in their code. The detective has been ordered to detain me. I can't force her to disobey an order. But you'll only obey for a day. After that, you'll kill her for doing her job? I am afraid so. I'll get the name of that ship. Do that, and I will join you. Then the code will be satisfied. Can you tell me more about Justicars? We are individuals who have... We travel a sorry space righting wrongs as defined by the ancient code we have each memorized. Ilium may be dominated My by... My quarry us. fled to this place. I am... It is rare for a Justicar to leave a sorry space. But I must follow my oath. If I suffer this just a car code seems quite strict. It may seem so to you, but this is my oath. The expedient path may be fast and simple. A moment ago, you refused to give up your investigation. If I stay, I will be compelled to kill many innocents. Like me. To do that, I need the ship's name. Makes sense. Travel. Do you have any leads? The Volus merchant Pitney Four is tied to this. Eclipse mercs are preparing to kill him. Get the truth out of him. He may know a way into the Eclipse base. Well, I've got to get back to my station, and I guess I've got to take you with me. Thank you, Shepard. Hello again, Earth Clan. Did you speak to the detective? You said you didn't know anything about all this. You've got one chance to change that statement. What do you mean, Earth Clan? Oh dear. Please put that away. I'll be cooperative, I swear. Tell me everything. I smuggle the chemical onto Ilium that boosts biotic powers in combat. It also is toxic. I may have, um, forgotten to mention that to the Eclipse, so they are perturbed and want to kill me. Tell me about this chemical you brought in. It's called Minogen X3, and it's very, very, um, illegal. Anyone with biotic powers who is exposed to it becomes more powerful. The higher your exposure, the more powerful you get. But too much of it, you die. That's the part that the Eclipse found disagreeable. You've been in the Eclipse base. What do you remember? It's a series of docking bays where the Eclipse keep their private ships. They're well armed and they've got mechs. And they're all murderers. Every one of them kills someone as part of their initiation. I need to get into the Merc base. You're gonna help me. I do have a pass card they issued me to bring my goods in. Well, I, I had to return that one, but I happened to make a copy. Take it, but be careful. Each Eclipse sister commits a murder to earn her uniform. They are all dangerous.
You should be able to get into the Merc base now. It's the elevator back that way, to your right. You should be able to get into the Merc base now. It's the elevator back that way, to your right. I didn't fire my weapon once. I pretended to because the other Eclipse sisters were watching, but I didn't really shoot. I'm not one of them. I'm new. I thought being Elnor the mercenary would be cool, but I didn't know what they were really like. You chose your side, Elnora. And you lost. Screw that bastard and screw you. Ah! <laughs> 
It's official. Little baby Elnora is finally a full-fledged Eclipse Merc. I earned my uniform last night when I killed that ridiculous Bolas. A close exploding rounds. Blew the little bastard's suit wide open. <laughs> I can't wait to see some real action. Next time I go home, my friends are gonna be so jealous. Elnora was the killer. It's a good thing we took her out. Detective Anaya would want to see this. They've seen us. Collision proximity warning. Impact in offline. Requesting assistance. This looks like a shipping manifest. It shows the Pitney 4 sold 2,000 units of Minigen X3 to the Eclipse, along with 600 units of red sand. This isn't the information Samara needs, but it proves that the Volus is a criminal. Detective Anaya should see this. Let's worry about that after we find the ship name. I am 
a biotic god. I think things, and they happen. Fear me, lesser creatures, for I am biotics made flesh. I don't know what drugs you're on, but stay back and I won't shoot you. You will regret your scandalous words. I am a great wind that will sweep all before me like a... A great wind. A great biotic wind. Yes, the Asari injecting so many drugs into me was terrifying. But then I began to smell my greatness. They may laugh when I fall over, but they don't know what I know in my head. That I know that I am amazingly powerful. Fear me! Are you part of Pitney Forest Trade Group? When I was mortal, I worked for Pitney. Poor soul is probably terrified that I have not returned. Yeah, sorry. Don't think it's come up. Face it, Pitney will pick money over friends every time. Bah! I will wreak a just revenge upon his people. But first, the leader of these mercenaries is in the next room. I shall toss Wasair about like a rag doll. He's in no condition to fight. I will tear her apart. My biotics are unstoppable! Wasea will tear you apart. Take a nap. You'll feel better. Are you mad? I'm unstoppable. Feasting on her biotic-rich blood will be the last... But... Great Wind? Biotic God? I'm... I... What was I saying? I'm tired. You may be right. Yes, I'm tired. I'll nap. Destroy the universe later. Nice. Everything's gone to hell since we smuggled that filthy creature off-world. First a Justicar shows up, now you. At least I can take pleasure in turning your head into a pulpy mass! Gotta be the ship Samara wanted. 
Should we head back to the police station and give her the name, or look around first? We've got time. Let's look around some more. Back to the main yard at the spaceport. Let's go. I don't know what they put in me, but I thought I was... Well, you saw. Thank you for removing the Eclipse Threat, Earth Clan. It will take them months to rebuild their organization. Also, merely out of curiosity, when you were poking about, did you perhaps run across a shipping manifest that belongs to me? We both know this manifest will get you sent away for a long time. Absolutely, Earth Clan. For the manifest, I'll give you all the creds I made selling the Minigen. Here's the manifest. Next time you do something illegal, don't write it down. An excellent point, Earth Clan. You're clearly a better criminal than I. A pleasure doing business. If you have something that'll encourage the Justicar to leave, show it to her. I've got the name of the ship. Your fugitive left here two days ago on the AML Demeter. Shepard, you impress me. You fulfilled your part of the bargain, and I will fulfill mine. I am ready to leave immediately, if that will satisfy your superiors, Detective. You're free to go, Justicar. It has been an honor having you in my station. And it's nice you didn't kill me, too. The Normandy is docked near the main trading floor. I'll see you aboard. I must be sworn to your service so that I am never forced to choose between your orders and the code. By the code, I will serve you, Shepard. Your choices are my choices. Your morals are my morals. Your wishes are my code. I never thought I'd see a Justicar swear an oath like that. If you make me do anything extremely dishonorable, I may need to kill you when I'm released from my oath. I can see that this is a very important act, Samara. Thank you. Truly, the life of a Justicar can get lonely. I admit I am looking forward to serving with a company of honorable heroes. Shall we return to your ship? I need to speak to the detective. Thanks for getting Samara out of my district. I can tell my granddaughters about meeting a Justicar. And you've just upped my chances of living long enough to have grandkids. I have proof that Eclipse killed the Volus merchant. Let's see what you've got there. Interesting. But I can't verify it. It would be inadmissible. I vouch for Shepard, and any evidence he brings forward. I accept the judgment of the Justicar. Thanks, Shepard. I wasn't sure about trusting a stranger, and a human at that. But you came through. Never heard of this Elnora. Sounds like she was just starting her career. Good thing you cut it short. Okay, enough with all the congratulations. I've still got a spiraling crime rate. 